Star Trek, The Next Generation. 35 years later. 1987 versus 2022. Star Trek, The Next Generation is an American science fiction television series created by Gene Roddenberry. It originally aired from September 28, 1987 to May 23, 1994 in syndication, spanning 178 episodes over seven seasons. The third series in the Star Trek franchise, it was inspired by Star Trek, the original series. Set in the 24th century, when Earth is part of the United Federation of Planets, it follows the adventures of a Starfleet starship, the USS Enterprise, and its exploration of the Milky Way galaxy. Let's review the characters of the TV series and how the actors who played them are now. Patrick Stewart as Captain Jean-Luc Picard is the commanding officer of the USS Enterprise-D. Stewart also played the character in the pilot episode of Deep Space Nine, all four TNG theater films, and in the eponymously titled latest series Star Trek, Picard. Jonathan Frakes as Commander William T. Riker is the ship's first officer. The Riker character was influenced by concepts for First Officer Willard Decker in the Star Trek Phase II television series. Decker's romantic history with helmsman Ilya was mirrored in the next generation in the relationship between Riker and Deanna Troy. Riker also appears in an episode each of Star Trek, Voyager and Star Trek, Enterprise, and later reprised the role in Star Trek, Picard, and in the animated Star Trek, Lower Decks. LeVar Burton as Lieutenant Commander Geordi LaForge was initially the ship's helmsman, but the character became chief engineer beginning in the second season. Burton also played the character in an episode of Voyager. Denise Crosby as Lieutenant Tasha Yar is the Chief of Security and Tactical Officer. Crosby left the series near the end of the first season, and the Yar character was killed. Yar returns in alternate timelines in the award-winning episode Yesterday's Enterprise and the series finale, All Good Things. Crosby also played Commander Sela, Yar's half-Romulan daughter. Michael Dorn as Lieutenant Worf is a Klingon. Worf initially appears as a junior officer fulfilling several roles on the bridge. When Denise Crosby left near the end of the first season, the Worf character succeeded Lieutenant Yar as the ship's chief of security and tactical officer. Dorn reprised the role as a regular in seasons 4 through 7 of Star Trek, Deep Space Nine, and also played another Klingon, also named Worf, in Star Trek VI, The Undiscovered Country, with 282 on-screen appearances, Dorn has the most appearances of any actor in the Star Trek franchise. Gates McFadden as Dr. Beverly Crusher is the Enterprise's chief medical officer. As a fully certified bridge officer, Dr. Crusher had the ability to command the Enterprise if circumstances required her to do so. She also, on occasion, commanded night watch shifts on the ship's main bridge to stay on top of Starship operations. McFadden was fired after the first season, but was rehired for the third season and remained for the remainder of the series. Her absence in the second season was explained by her transfer to Starfleet Medical. Diana Muldor as Dr. Catherine Pulaski was created to replace Dr. Crusher for the show's second season. Muldor, who previously appeared in two episodes of the original Star Trek, never received billing in the opening credits. Instead, she was listed as a special guest star during the first act. Marina Sirtis, as Commander Deanna Troy, is the half-human, half-betazoid ship's counselor. Starting in the Season 7 episode Thine Own Self, Counselor Troy, having taken and completed the bridge officer's test, is later promoted to the rank of commander, which allowed her to take command of the ship and also perform bridge duties other than those of a ship's counselor. The character's relationship with First Officer Riker was a carryover from character ideas developed for Phase 2. 
Troy also appeared in later episodes of Voyager, in the finale of Enterprise, and in the first season of Picard. Brent Spiner as Lieutenant Commander Data is an android who serves as second officer and operations officer. Data's outsider's perspective on humanity served a similar narrative purpose as Spock's in the original Star Trek. Spiner also played his brother, Lore, and his creator, Noonien Sung. In Enterprise, Spiner played Noonien's ancestor, Arik, and contributed a brief voiceover heard over the Enterprise DS intercom in the Enterprise finale. In 2020, Spiner reprised the role of Data, as well as Dr. Alton Inigo Song, Noonien's prodigy, in Picard. Will Wheaton is Beverly Crusher's son Wesley. He becomes an acting ensign, and later receives a field commission to ensign, before attending Starfleet Academy. After being a regular for the first four seasons, Wheaton appeared sporadically as Wesley Crusher for the remainder of the series. Nigel Barrett as Waxana Troy, Federation Ambassador and Deanna Troy's mother, also the voice of the ship's computer. Brian Bonsall as Alexander Rosenko, Worf's son. Rosalind Chow as Keiko O'Brien, botanist until her transfer to Deep Space Nine in 2369. Denise Crosby as Sela, Romulan commander, and Tasha Yar's daughter. John Delancey as Q, a member of the Q Continuum who frequently visits the USS Enterprise D. Jonathan Del Arco is Hugh, a Borg drone who was disconnected from the collective by Geordi Law Forge and Beverly Crusher. Michelle Forbes as Roe Laren, con officer until her defection to the Maquis in 2370. Whoopi Goldberg as Guinan, bartender hostess on the USS Enterprise D. Ashley Judd is Robin Leffler, engineering officer on the USS Enterprise D. Andreas Katzelas as Tomalak, a Romulan commander who has several encounters with the USS Enterprise D. Barbara March as Lursa, Klingon officer from the House of Duras and better as sister. Colm Meany as Miles O'Brien, con officer and later transporter chief until his transfer to Deep Space Nine in 2369. Eric Miniuk as the Traveler, a member of a species from Tau Alpha C who mentors Wesley Crusher. Lisha Naff as Sonia Gomez, engineering officer on the USS Enterprise D. Natalia Nagulik as Elena Necheyev, flag officer in charge of Cardassian affairs. Robert O'Reilly as Gowron, leader of the Klingon Empire.
Susie Plaxon as Kalir, Federation Ambassador, mate to Worf and Alexander Rosenko's mother until her death in 2367. Dwight Schultz as Reginald Barkley, engineering officer until his transfer to Starfleet Communications in 2374. Karel Struikin as Mr. Hong, Waxana Troy's attendant. Tony Todd as Ken, Klingon officer and Worf's brother. GWYNYTH Walsh is better, Klingon officer from the house of Duras and Lurs's sister. Hedi Yasutaki is Alyssa Ogawa, medical officer and head nurse. Ken Thorley is Moat. Barber on the USS Enterprise D. Daniel Davis as Professor Moriarty as a holodeck character who becomes self-aware. That's it for this video. Remember, please, subscribe and like it. Leave us in comments which TV series or movie you want us to make a video of. Looking forward to seeing you in the next one. Thank you for watching.